Hello everybody, it's Ms. Morgan at the Romeoville branch of the White Oak Library District and today we're going to be doing a book talk. So the first book I've got for you guys is Chef Yasmina and Potato Panic by Walter Maner. And this is about Yasmina who loves to cook and the only thing she needs to do so is her cookbook and veggies from the community garden. But then a shadowy uh, corporation shows up and bulldozes the community garden down and in its place they plant potatoes that her neighbors cannot resist and once they take a bite they start acting really, really strangely. So now it's up to Yasmina to figure out what is wrong with these potatoes and hopefully how to cure everybody. Uh, this one is a graphic novel and this one's really cool. I really like the art in this one. Um, you don't have your normal like boxes, but you still really got the structure of a comic. And I think that's really, really fun. If you like kind of uh, uh, maybe more of a sketchy style for art, you might really like Yasmina and the Potato Panic by Walter Maner. Uh, the next book we've got is The Hat Makers by Tamsin Merchant. And this is about Cordelia. And Cordelia lives in a London where magic is real and it's interwoven into everyday objects by the five maker families. And Cordelia is the youngest hat maker, so she's grown up her entire life learning the secrets of their family's like ancient skill. But when her father is lost at sea, Cordelia could only think of trying to find him again. Her aunt and uncle, however, are a little bit more concerned with the ancient rivalry between the maker families that's starting to resurface. And on top of all of that, it looks like someone is actually using maker magic to start a war. So now it's up to Cordelia to figure out who is doing it and why they would and hopefully how to stop it. So if you like a little bit of fantasy and you like some adventure, you might really like The Hat Makers by Tamsin Merchant. And the last book we've got is Dragon Kingdom of Renly, The Cold Fire Curse. And this one is by Jordan Quinn and illustrated by Ornella Greco. And this one is about Ruskin, who has lived his whole life as the pet of the Prince of Renly. And then one day, so that's Ruskin, he's the dragon. And then one day another dragon shows up and tells him that there is a curse on the loose in Renly and that hopefully Ruskin can stop it. And so for the first time in his life, Ruskin leaves the castle and leaves his home to try to save the kingdom and stop the curse. So this one's another graphic novel. If you like, again, fantasy, and if you like dragons especially, and you like dragons to be your main character, Characters, you might really really enjoy this one this one the colors in this one are so bright and so vibrant I really love the art in this one as well so that's Dragon Kingdom of Renly the Cold Fire Curse uh, by Jordan Quinn and illustrated by Ornella Greco and this is the first in a series and we have a volume two as well so you might want to check that out I hope you guys enjoyed the books and we'll see you next time bye